Hello Divas, Diamonds and Dolls. Welcome back to our YouTube channel, Femininity with Mama Gail. Today, let's talk about presents. We are going to talk about physical presents and we are going to talk about stage presents. There is a difference in physical presence and stage presence. Feminine physical presence. You are feminine. You've worked on your femininity. You have feminine energy, feminine aura, feminine presence feminine you are attractive you are beautiful you are calm you are peaceful you are nurturing you are tender you are radiant you are flowing in the fluidity of your feminine energy you have presence because you have worked on yourself and you have tapped into being present wherever and whenever you show up. Being present does not mean being physically in a room. I am present right now talking to you over video. You can show up on Zoom. You can show up at meetings. You can show up over the phone in feminine presence. It's in your voice. It's in your attitude. It's in your the way you present yourself. It's in your body language, your sensuality, and the tone of your voice and things of that nature. You are working your feminine energy all together and showing up present to wherever you are. And because you are showing up something different, something rare, something valuable, people see you. People take notice of you because you're real. You are authentic. You are free. You are confident. When I say real and authentic, I mean the real you. And I say authentic because you're not being a copycat of somebody else. But you're showing up as who you are. This is me. I love me. I've worked on me. I know my identity. I know who I am. So when you when you walk into a room, when you show up to a meeting, when you show up on a video, when you show up wherever you are, because you are who you are, you're comfortable with who you are, no judgment, no insecurity, no I don't give up that baby's behind about what you say or think about me because you show up so free people are drawn to who you are the realness all of this fakeness in the world fakeness on social media we take millions and thousands of pictures and posting every day because our lives are boring and we have nothing to do but be on social media and paint a picture of ourselves for people to like so that we can feel good about ourselves. When you show up, you're showing up authentically you. Not because you need somebody else's approval, but this is who I am. And in being who you are, you've worked on yourself. You're flowing in the majority and more of your feminine energy. So showing up is not a problem for you. And people take notice because of the realness the freedom, the liberty of who you have chosen to be. Your confidence is on flake. You don't care what anybody else says or thinks. All of this entwined in your feminine energy with your femininity, it gives you feminine presence. Now, there is also stage presence. Stage presence is whether you're an introvert, an extrovert, or whatever kind of vert you are. You show up 
when it's time to perform, when it's time to show up, to get on stage and sing, to dance, to read a poem for a business meeting, when it's time for you to kick into full gear and be who it is that you need to be for that moment, for that time, you have stage presence. You show up to perform and then you turn right back into the introvert that you have always been. You are a turtle. You come out the shell to get to where you need to be. But when you're in fear, when you're threatened by something, when you're not sure of your surroundings and what's going on, you crawl back into the safe place of the shell, knowing that people can't harm you inside the shell. But you know how to come out when you need to, to perform stage presence. Your feminine presence is not just physically walking into a building. You can be on Zoom and have stage presence. You can be on YouTube, these videos, TikTok, whatever your platform is and have feminine presence and show up and be whoever you need to be for showing up on your platform. When you're doing these videos, there are different audiences for different people, but you must have presence, whether it's feminine presence or simply presence to reach your audience. You have to show up and give them something real, authentic, that you are free to share whatever it is that you're sharing and you're confident in the videos that you're making because you bring presence. This is who I am. Take me or leave me. Watch me or don't. Subscribe or don't. Like, comment, or don't. It's still, I am still who I am. I am still present. I am still fabulous with or without your permission. Showing up in presence. If you have meetings on Zoom or you have to get on camera when it's lights, camera, action. If you're the boss, flip, flip the switch on and turn into full boss mode. But when it's time, the meeting is over and it's time to go and cater to hubby and take care of the kids, turn that switch off and go right back into being whoever you are having presence you don't have to be feminine to have presence but when you're feminine you have presence because when you're feminine you flow in your feminine energy you are a receiver you're open to receive you are laid back you are relaxed you are inviting people come people are drawn People trust something in you because there's something in you that says I can be trusted because I am loving. I have this energy of love, this aura of love, this aura of peace, this aura of calm, this energy that says you have something that I need. So when you're present and you show up 
in feminine presence, it doesn't matter what anybody else says or thinks. It's the fact that you show up and like it or not, they have to acknowledge that they take notice, they pay attention, they respect whatever that is that you have, even if they don't want you to have it. They may not, may not like you, but they'll have to respect you because you have something that's rare, that's different, that shows up and lights up a room. Feminine presence. The presence to perform, stage presence, flip it on, flip it off. If you're not confident yet in your feminine walk, think about these celebrities out here. When you see them interviewing, you don't see them interview as who they are on stage presence. When you see Beyonce interviewing or talking with her husband or at a game or something, she's not as elegant and elaborate as she is when she's on stage performing. She transitions and turns into a whole nother creature. Nicki Minaj. When you hear her talking about her past, about her life, interviewing about something, that's not the same Nikki that you see in Chung Li. She's a beast in Chung Li. She knows how to flip performance on lights, camera, action. And she's in full mode. But when it's time to talk in interview, she's not talking in stage performance. Chung Lee, she's talking to you in presence. When you look at actors, Denzel Washington, when you see him interviewing, educated, conversating, he's different from when you see him, American Gangster, Training Day. He transitioned into who it is that he needs to play, to be who he needs to be on stage. Lights, camera, action. Stage presence is different from personal presence. Personal presence you take with you everywhere you go. You turn on stage presence and be more present in your physical presence when you work on yourself turn on turn off stage be flow you are in personal presence this is femininity with mama gal don't forget to like and subscribe to my youtube channel divas diamonds and dolls have a blessed and prosperous day